Hey, this is Kevin from Breakdance, and in this video, we're going to go over some ways you can add an image to the center of your header. One of the easiest ways to do this in Breakdance is to simply add it from the library. So we will go to Add, Library, and we'll select the Samba design set. And then under Headers, if you scroll down the page, you will see a header already ready for you that has an image in the center. If we add that to the page, We'll see that this uses column elements with a WP menu, a wrapper link with our image, and then some columns with buttons. This is a quick and convenient way to get an image in the center of your header. With the menu custom area, it's also possible to do this using the menu builder. We'll start by getting rid of the header builder we already added, and we're gonna add a new header builder and a new menu builder element. Within the menu builder element, we're gonna add a menu custom area as well as a menu button. And then we're going to move the menu custom area right up the middle. We're not going to touch any of the menu items because that is not a part of this video. We're just going to focus on the image. Within the menu custom area, we're going to add a wrapper link because we want to make sure that the image is clickable. And then we want to add the image itself. And we'll go ahead and we will choose a image here and we'll go ahead and set the wrapper link. We now have the image in the middle of our menu, but we want to make sure that this menu expands all the way across and that there's some nice even spacing. This can be done by selecting the menu builder, going to settings, and opening the advanced tab. We're now going to add some custom CSS to get the menu builder to expand all the way across the page and to space all the items out evenly. So the first thing we're going to do is we're just going to click into here and with the selector we're going to set the width to 100%. We now see that this goes all the way across. Next we want to target the breakdance menu list class. So we're going to go selector, breakdance, menu, list and then do our opening and closing tags. Set the width again to 100%. And then we're going to set justify content to space between. And just like that, we now have a header with an image in the middle and our content spaced out evenly. With our menu created and the image in the center, one thing you might notice on mobile is that the image is still in the center of our list. You may find you want to change this. And again, this is very easy to do with some custom CSS. Learning custom CSS is only going to enhance your ability as a developer. So we always encourage using it and learning it whenever you can. To change the location of the logo, we want to change the order of where it appears within the list of items. So all we're going to do is we're going to select the menu custom area. We're going to go to the advanced CSS tab. And with our current responsive control selected, we're going to add order negative one. This pushes this list item all the way to the top so that it shows as the very first thing. And for a quick aesthetic purpose, we're going to change align items to center. And just like that, we now have a centered logo on mobile with the logo all the way at the top of the menu. So let's close this. Let's go back to our desktop and we can see that the logo is still in the center here. And then once we drop to a responsive breakpoint, we can now see that the logo is all the way at the top. These are just two quick examples of how to get a centered logo on your design in Breakdance. 